Welcome back guys. Doing something a bit different this weekend. We're doing an overnight bike touring trip. All of our cycling gear is still stuck in Western Australia. So this is our janky setup for the weekend. It's a bit of a test run, should be all right. The important thing is getting out there. Only take a one sleeping bag. So we're gonna be uh, cozying up tonight. All right, let's do this. We start on the Roxborough Gorge Trail, cycling 10 kilometers along the Clutha River from Alexandra to Doctors Point. This section of the trail ends at Doctors Point. You then take a 13 kilometre jet boat ride to Shingle Creek, the start of the next section. The 45 minute boat tour is a memorable one, as the local guide delves deeper into the gorge's history and the gold miners that inhabited the riverbanks. Still got the um, original bed inside. The mortars just cut itself from the river, basically. That's the original stuff. She arrived here in 1863 with her husband and built this nice little cottage over here. Yeah, lived here 14 years, eventually abandoned that. They built the commercial hotel, so if you go to Rock, where you'll see a two-story pub and hotel, that's the commercial hotel. A bit of a legacy of that. Oh, and she lived to 96 years old. <laughs> She'd have been a good little fat lad, is that right? <laughs> Oh, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Okay, interesting. Room service? Yeah. From Shingle Creek, the trail continues for 11 kilometers to Roxborough Dam. With long sweeping vistas of Lake Roxborough, this section of the trail is a special one. an e-bike yet? She said no. After climbing the switchbacks you will reach the Roxborough Dam lookout and the end of this trail. A short cycle over the dam connects you with the start of the Clutha Gold Trail.
a further 10 kilometres along the Clutha River will take you to the township of Roxburgh. You can cross the bridge and spend the night here, but we decided to continue a further 20 kilometres to the small town of Miller's Flat. Miller's Flat is a quaint little town. There is a holiday park with a mix of different accommodation options and a cafe or a pub you can grab a meal from. After breakfast at the cafe, we ride 25 kilometres to the pub at Beaumont, where we'll stop to have lunch. From there it is a further 20 kilometres to the town of Lawrence, where we've organised transport back to Alexandra. You just resting? What? Set a stop for Where's my treat? <laughs> oh, my butt. I do what the signs tell me to do. Worth it? You cycled over a hundred kilometers for an ice cream. Mm -hmm. Could have just gone down the street. It's better this way. Me and the locals. It's a hard life in uh, Lawrence, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs>